salsa. Salsa. Right. Sorry. Okay, so lesson when you're dealing with lady things, don't be like lady things. Lady lady things and lady things. Don't be too many drinks in that you can't function because I'm starting to let's get this. He's not a lightweight. He's cocktail. pretending to be a lightweight. He's not a um, lightweight. No, because I haven't eaten this delicious food That's yet. That's true. Okay, so I call this Sylvia Shasla because my mom found this recipe. It's 100% raw, which is the best part about the salsa, is you don't have to fucking cook it for hours on end. Do people cook salsa? It's called yeah. spaghetti sauce. No, they, they cook, like, they're, like they roast the chilies oh, okay, and right. shit like that. Okay, so what you're gonna need is serrano peppers, green onions, cilantro, and avocados, and some of this delicious chicken stock. And tomatillos. Oh, we're, oh. See, so he's <laughs> Forgetful. Um, okay, so first of all, Eddie gave me credit for a, a tip about oh, sticky things right. that I didn't give him. So take credit for it and tell okay. him. So somebody, if it wasn't Christine, I wish, said, it, I wish it were. You me. know how cucumbers have like that slicky little like slimy sometimes. Not as much as tomatillos. tomatillos but Those are crazy. Tomatillos. These are crazy. crazy. A little drop of dish soap, just a little, to wash like three of them at the same time, and then they're they're not sticky anymore, and then. They're great to handle and they're washed. And, and they're washed. Does it, it kill two birds with one stone thing? Right. We don't kill birds on this channel though. <laughs> no. I feed them. I feed them en masse on oh my, my patio. God. There's morning doves and now they look like turkeys on a wire. They are <laughs> so full. They're so fucking fat. Fucking fat. <laughs> yeah, Alright, so how many tomatillos are we using? Uh, six big ones if they're like this size. Or seven and or eight. And that's the size of a pool ball. Maybe just a little bit smaller than a pool ball. Or a golf ball? Bigger than a golf ball. Bigger than a golf ball, smaller than, than a pool ball. ball. <laughs> All about balls over here. We're very specific about ball there, size. I mean, we're very specific. So, but I like to get so you want six of those ball-sized um, tomatillos. I don't need six. Two works for me, but <laughs> depends on uh, how spicy the sauce is. <laughs> how spicy the evening is gone. <laughs> Suddenly there's six. So anyway, I always keep a couple extra on hand. Uh, just in case the situation of the salsa gets too salty. I love that. I love it as, as a save. <laughs> they make things too salty all the time, so <laughs> trust me. So he's got two. He's got two balls aside on the side. On the he's side. Got balls on the I've side. Balls on the side. It's not cool. Hose in different area codes. All right, balls I count those shit. Oh. Okay. All right, so now we're using some round peppers, and we, all he did was cut the top off. So it's the whole thing with all the seeds. The seeds are going to make them hot. If you are a pussy and you don't want your hot, your salsa hot, seed these. Or use jalapenos. Jalapenos aren't as spicy as serrano. Yes. And um, my mom, when she makes the salsa, she's always like, they're like, oh, shit, this has a kick. It's super hot. And my mom says, well, they all, the saying is, if the salsa is hot, because the person who made it was mad. So I'm pissed at everybody. Count that Another shit. One, two, four, yeah. five, six, seven, eight, nine. You can always go hotter. Sorry, girls. That's fucking gonna be hot. I promise but you. It's, it's that good hot though, because it still has flavor. I've had is I've had this salsa and it is very good. And it's ju it's just the exact level of hot for my taste. But hot is a very personal yes, thing. Yes, yes, that's true. Um. So start with four and see where you're because i have friends that are very sensitive to heat pussies we call yes. them pussies they don't get to have this all the time and then we have this I have a bunch. bunch of cilantro so we discussed this too he's only going to cut the stems off like the trunk of the tree basically yes. um i was told one time that the that you should <laughs> yeah that you should pull every leaf off of those remaining stems <laughs> that uh the cilantro <laughs> would be bitter and i <laughs> I said that I, I, it'd be much more bitter for me if I had to pull all the leaves off those stems. I would be the bitter one at that No, absolutely. Time. And you know what? I did that one. I, my mom told me the recipe. And you're like, ting, 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 ting. Uh, I was like, this is going to be the special like, salsa. Eh, eh, all right, eh. here we go. And By the time you get through that shit, like... The you're mad. And you put 45 <laughs> fucking serrano in there. Yeah. <laughs> exactly what happened. Um, and this is two bunches of green onions. I'm gonna take or out scallions, as they're known. Who? By the did I tell you that? What? I was looking for. I was making a recipe, and they called them scallions. And it was a You're recipe like, I've never made. A I went through the supermarket to two different supermarkets actually, looking for scallions. I didn't want to ask anybody. 
I was looking for scallions, and all I found was green onions. But I did, and then I later went home and went, oh, it's the same shit. They need to tell you this. I just did. In high school, or the... In home ec. Or, or Christine's YouTube channel. Yeah, no. That wasn't... Um, Can I have one of those? Well, yeah, just one? Sure. So he's going to he's gonna use all but the, the little hairy, little, uh, you know, like yeah. Bart, Bart Simpson hairdo at the top. <laughs> I, when I use scallions, I... Some recipes want you to use the white part. Typically, they want you to use the green part. If you cut it somewhere, give it a little bit more room than just the just the scalping of, of Bart Simpson. Why? Then you put it in a glass of water, and they grow out again. They don't grow out like this stiff and like... Uh -huh. <laughs> Balls and stiffness. This is a good They're channel. not as stiff as this, but but they are scallions. And they can grow to be giant, like this big around. They can be this thick, Eddie. Huge! This is the sexiest is show I've ever done. Is that a scallion in your pocket, or are you just happy to shame me? <laughs> it's a scallion. <laughs> um, you can regrow them in a glass of, not red wine, but in water, and they will grow and... I didn't have to oh show that so pornographic. Red onions. Yeah, right? Right. Is that what we're, be a hybrid? We're, we're a hybrid of green and red onions. Become That's purple. Genetic Pur physicists, biologists. I don't know how we're not working in the Biden administration right now. We're obviously brilliant. I'm waiting for, I had, I had a call come in. I'm going to check that. Well, check that message. <laughs> I, I don't know if my, you heard my dogs fighting over us trying to talk a minute ago. They're both wearing sweaters. They're Hayden's wearing a, a hoodie. Moxie's wearing a sweater. Earlier I had the sweater on Moxie and the hood fell over her tiny little head. She's got a shiny tiny, we call it. It's tiny, but it's shiny. It's a very <laughs> um, sought-after quality in a Boston Terrier drawing. By the way, she also... Eddie's Mexican and I'm Bostonian and Moxie, my Moxie, come here, Mom. She would be our love child. She's our baby. She's part Bostonian and part Mexican oh, and Mexican also girl. part Michael Caine, apparently, in the sweater. <laughs> and she's very jolly. Which, <laughs> she's she also loves, miserable. She's going to kill me loves, in my sleep. She loves us, but she loves to wear that sweater. No, she does not. And I might die in my sleep tonight. <laughs> yes, but she's Bostonian Mexican and she's very feisty. And that's she gets it for both of us. Yeah. Boston and Mexico. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so I have a bigger thing in my jagger, but let's try and whip it down. Okay. And if we don't, if we can't fit it all, he wanted a bigger one. <laughs> and I said no, that'll do. But maybe don't he's tell right. me. <laughs> maybe he's right. Maybe he needs a bigger one. So if in fact he does, we'll come back. We'll fix that shit. But oh my god, now I'm drunk. How'd that See? happen? It's like you take your eyes off the rice. There you Just go. You, know. you have to drink twice. Cheers. <laughs> oh my god. This is going to go well. Mm. We haven't got to get done so we can watch okay. Drag Race. Yes, UK, UK Drag, Drag Race. Race. Anybody watching UK Drag Race, leave a comment on Christine's page. And tell me who your favorite queen is because you're immediately my best friend the minute you watch that. It's a fucking good show. Everybody on UK, everyone, everyone on the UK version this season is awesome. There's you're nobody sorry. you're like, who's that cunt? I can't take it anymore. They're all like... Awesome, 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 awesome. Yes. So, yes. And there's a couple of fave. I have one. Uh, uh, agreed. Love them all. Bimini Bamboo Lash is like one of my faves. Oh. So, avocados. Three extra, or three large ones, or six small ones is about the, because it adds a creaminess to the, the salsa. Both? Both. What's the difference? Pulsing jogs it around a little bit, so it jogs it. Oh. If you just put it on, it's it'll whip the bottom, and everything will stay at the top like that. Mm. Oh, I've got so many tips for you guys. So many fucking important tips. Meanwhile, I changed from red, white wine to red wine during the course of this. And Eddie has consumed all of this vodka. No, he hasn't. Oh, look. You and, didn't, you didn't need... Go ahead, go. They say you can't operate heavy machinery after a couple drinks. It's not recommended. We're safe though. Oh, yeah, it wasn't big enough? Was that... Yeah, look. Plenty big. Plenty big. Okay. Well... Just trust me next time. Let's see. <laughs> That's my biggest issue is what my therapist says. Ha! <laughs> like, I... Oh! oh that I was so excited, I just jumped right out! <laughs> He's like, I don't trust you! Talk about therapy, that avocado I needs some. <laughs> so right. I was trying to get the seed out of the avocado uh, by having it halved as such and then taking a knife and slamming it into the seed and then twisting it and it pulls the seed out, in theory. 
Um, these are kind of young, and yeah. I also had cut one not in the half, it was a little bit more than half, so the seed was really nested in there. And Eddie brought up a thing called avocado hand. Don't Google it if you're about to cut some avocados. Do Google it before you cut them. But don't like, wait till after. Don't wait, don't wait till after. Um, yeah, it's weird how it's like a whole... Like how is the avocado hand... That's how we grew up cutting avocados. How else do you fucking cut it? I, we didn't have avocados in Boston. I'm sticking to that story. <laughs> I never had an avocado until I moved to LA. I never had an avocado. I never had sushi. Really? What? I never, it's, yeah, it's Boston. We eat potatoes. And butter and rice, which still sounds delicious. I didn't eat that shit, but I, I ate the hot dogs and hamburgers and steak and spaghetti. You don't like pasta, which is fucking bizarre. Okay, wait, hold on. I don't not like it. It's just like nothing I crave or like my first immediate response when I see it on an Italian menu. <laughs> In fairness, you do eat meat, so the rest of yeah. the menu is open to you. Sure. When you don't eat meat or fish or anything, then suddenly pasta is your, is your lover. Like, seriously, like, oh, it's a dirty show today, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not sorry. You like that pasta, huh? You like <laughs> yeah, that pasta? Yes. You like yes. that pasta? You like that rigatoni? <laughs> you like that linguine, baby? <laughs> you know, it's four o'clock. I shoot the show in the morning, typically. We're, that's why I'm drunk. It's four. You're allowed to be drunk at four during COVID. Yeah, it's, it's appropriate. Cheers. Required. Required. And we're in our own safe pod. Mm -hmm. So there's that. So that. And okay. if you have any problem with it, write to RuPaul at RuPaul's Drag Race. And don't bother us. And don't bother don't us. Pulse, pulse, baby. There you go. All right. It so, all fit. Oh. Yeah, I knew it would. Wait. Because I know. Now that it's in there. No. It's like you cook. It's like I've cooked before. <laughs> and again, the vegan chicken stock, which I would never think to put in a salsa. It's good. So, dude. Oh, and garlic salt. Oh, I hid that from you. Let me oh, get shit. it. Here it is. So Christine, way, Christine did ask me, she's like, are all the ingredients? I'm like, yeah, let's go. Let's do it, bitch. <laughs> I don't know how I approach life anyway, but. Also, right. weirdly, um, Eddie and I and another person who's in our pod, all on, was it Monday or Tuesday? All of us decided to wake up that day and put on pants with a button for the first time. I, I, like, I'm yeah. wearing them now. Like, no, we felt like, and, oh, I'm wearing pants with a button. Oh, sorry. Well, that was Hayden. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. It feels like an accomplishment. It does. You're like, I'm ready to kick ass today. I, I, I pulled them, I, I already, I'm wearing the same ones I wore last time I said I was wearing button pants. But, um, Me too. I'm I afraid to try a second a pair. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid a second pair won't fit as well, so. Uh. <laughs> okay, so, should we try it? We can't open it, it's broken. <laughs> yes, we should try it. It's locked. I never try food on this channel, or I seldom, seldom do. Should we spoon some out? Use that spoon, put them on the plate, let's have it. Or should we just dip right in the fucking thing? I can do it, I pretty much whatever we want. Are these the magic chips? Except they don't have the chili on the, the mm -hmm. it, so they're less salty. So the magic are, chips are so fucking good. Talk about these, tell the peoples. Okay, so, I love a fucking good Mexican store that has its own homemade tortilla chips. I'm getting verklempt because it means a lot to me. No, they're just the best fucking chips. So if you have, <laughs> So if you have a superior market next to you, they have the best fucking, like, chili garnish chips that are super salty, but they're awesome. They're so fucking good. These are also delicious, but it's the quality of the crispness of the chip, mm -hmm. you know, and they have that. And it's part of... It's legit. They make it there. It's and it's, legit. it's not, you know, Tostitos brand. We hate that. We hate this giant corporate shit. No, but in a pinch. In a pinch. pinch. I know, that's sad. Okay. Is it not salty enough? That's what I think it's you're going to say. It's not salty enough. <laughs> mm. It has a good kick. Mm. Do you remain not salty enough? I think you could use some more salt. It's a little bit, right? Maybe if these were the other chips that are saltier, then we wouldn't need that. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's good. See, I, I don't do this on the show very much. Mm -mm -mm -mm. For my guests, I always do. If you, I've only had a few guests. I had Jay, my ex-boyfriend, Jamie, uh -huh. and his wife, uh, Marie. They had their black flower have, crepes. I was going to say, these are just crepes, right? I had the came on to crepes. My friend, Evan, came on and did a mushroom, my rag, mushroom stroganoff. And Neil Hamburger came on and made tamales, vegan tamales that were insane. Holy shit. 
Uh, my other friend is Simone Trickington. They came on and made uh, Holy shit. a smorgasbord. It was crazy. Mm. So, you mm. added some more stuff to the salsa. Yes, I added the remainder Ooh. of the... They haven't been blended yet. No. Okay. I added the remainder of Three, the... Three, because there's a fourth here. Did you just toss it in? Fuck yeah. I mean, how brave are we? We're, we're brave. We're not fucking scared of anybody. Oh, we're super brave. Also, we decided not to let these green onions feel like they're left also out. Also known as scallions. Nobody hates that. Nope. All right. Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, right. I'm never invited back. <sighs> Jesus. So fired. Take your balls and leave. Take your balls <laughs> and get out of ball. here. Take your balls. Go home. <laughs> leave your sleep. chips. <laughs> okay. One more test try. Yep. Uh, while we're test trying this, I want you to tell them what happened with the beans. So we opened up the, uh, after the 45 minutes and some extra time of it, like decompressing at the Instapot, mm -hmm. we opened it. And tell us what happened and why. What it's tell us what's going on in there. So when you open it up, Christine was like, "Is there supposed to be that much water in there?" And like, "Yeah, actually, because you store it like that. And unless you want to do refried beans, that extra water helps in the absorption. So there, you don't need to add extra water to create the refried beans because um, it's called. We call it the um, the the caldo, which is like kind of like the bean soup, which it's like bean stock essentially, mm -hmm. pinto bean stock." Which is so fucking good. If you can just get a tortilla and you like shop it up like a biscuit. Yeah, a biscuit. A biscuit. It's, it's really fucking good. So right. anyway, it's supposed to look watery. It doesn't look like rice at the end that we cooked. You know, absorbs all the water. There's supposed to be water there. So, yeah. And we have given you rice and beans and salsa. All your grandmother's recipes? All or some of your mother's? Um, salsa, your mother salsa. is from Boston. Your mother. Salsa. <laughs> salsa is my mother's. And the rice and beans are my grandmother's. I love it. It's perfect. And guess what? This went very well for us. I think I'll have Eddie back because he lives very close. And he's the only person I can see in the world. <laughs> that makes sense. Right. Okay. Cheers. That's it. Please subscribe. Don't judge. Wear a mask. Don't be a fucking dick. What do you right. want to say, Eddie? See you next time. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> We're so stupid. <laughs>